Hi guys, um, it's Wednesday. I'm going to make this one very quick um, because i got to finish packing this house up. Tomorrow i got to clean this house. Friday i got to clean. <laughs> I've got two houses I'm moving into. Um, we're moving into a cabin, which I love. It's with 15 acres, and then um, which we'll be purchasing later, crossing my fingers, to stay in temporarily till my home originally I'm supposed to move into, because these people are supposed to move out in five to ten days. So, and I'm not going to move into it until I get it clean the way I like it. So, um, so I'm going to move to pack today, clean this house to tomorrow, and then move officially out but um i don't know i think it's going to be about a one to two weeks oh, before um i get my internet turned on so but i'll post and i'll upload it as i go along to, through my brother-in-law's house but um i'm worn out i'm sore because i had to mow the yard over the weekend so my muscles did work that wasn't supposed to be it hasn't been used in over two years so but hey <laughs> it's well you dumb dog it's a bee stupid sorry guys my dog's got this big old bumblebee he thinks he's gonna stupid sorry but um i'm gonna make this a quick post because my friend just brought me bukus of boxes and i didn't realize how much my kitchen in this house is huge and I mean it's wall to wall cabinets and I didn't realize how much of a kitchen I had till I started boxing it up but other than that um Monday I go down and I come back down to the valley which is here to get my mold shots for my mold and all that crap that's in my blood um I'm worn out taking my B12 shot so I can have the energy to do all this crap. Um, let's see here, but um, I'll be posting along, and then when I, I'll do videos and post as I go, and then when I get to my brother-in-law's, I'll upload the crap. Not crap. I'm sorry. Um, I, my mind's 20 miles to everywhere, and then my, I know I'm gonna say things that don't have nothing to do with Lyme, but. My Shih Tzu's in heat, and then I got my Pit Bull, who, he's not even two, and my Shih Tzu's seven, and he, my Pit Bull, my Pit Bull, la, la, la. like, a, my Pit Bull's never had him none, and my Shih Tzu's never got her any, so he don't know if to shit or wind his watch, and she don't know what's going on, and I don't want no shitty pits, <laughs> I'm sorry. It's been a bad, I've been up since three. And it's just, dude. And it's been nonstop. Go, 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 go. Pack, 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 pack. I'm not talking to you. Um, and trying to keep these two apart. And I'm slinging her in a room. And he's whining. And it's, it's everything. So, I mean, go sit down. Thank you. Talk to my pet. But, um, so, it's just between packing and then keeping him away from her and her and every time I turn my back she's like this and it sit good girl like what I'm doing <laughs> so it's just non-stop everything it's just but I will, I will record and, um because I, I guess this is going to turn out to be a little bit of um Showing the home I'm fixing to move into that will be purchasing that property with the cabin and then going through my Lyme treatment because there's wild herbs everywhere and you know since I've decided I'm going to go the herbal way of treating my late stage Lyme in Rocky Mountain. So and I, I already been on the property and there's all kinds of wild herbs that are edible and good for it so. I'll, I'll do some recordings and everything and post that as I go along. And I mean, I've lived off the land before, so this is no big deal for me. But my husband, on the other hand, <laughs> this is going to be fun for him because this poor man, I mean, he knows how to, he knows how to do tobacco. 
since he was a kid, but living off the land? No. He has no clue how to forage or start a fire, keep a fire going. Yeah, it's it's going to be fun for him. This is going to be an adventure for him. This is, it's all good for me. So, I mean, but I'll record and I'll post as I go. And then when I get to my brother-in-law's until my internet gets turned on within about 10 days after I move up this weekend, you know, I'll, I'll post it. It's going to be an adventure. So I'm looking on the bright side of it because it's going to be peaceful and quiet. No drama. No, I know i got to come down only two, three times off the mountain to the doctors and it's going to be great. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. So, you know, and uh, all I know is where I'm moving to right now temporarily is if all I know is what my husband said, if you hear banjos, you better run. That's how far back in the uh, the country I'm going to be at the moment till I get into my house house till that woman moves out of it. So, that's all I know is because when I went down there, I mean, it's in the boonies. And the only house besides mine, which I'm at the end of the road, <coughs> cemetery, gate, which is my gate, big old gate. Got to unlock it, and then it's my house at the end of the road and 15 acres of wild, never touched, pristine land. But the, house, the property that's before mine, it's that property cemetery then my gated house yeah that's the dun 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 yeah i'm gonna grab my pit my gun and hide that's definitely run for the hills banjo music right there now them people kind of freak me out i mean they got kids but i like to sneak in the woods <laughs> Record and go, yeah, here you go. This is what I'm talking about. So, I mean, yeah, I'm going to, I know it's all supposed to be about lime, but, I mean, we have good days, and I guess this is just, you know, it's going to be about my life of my good days, my bad days, my treatments, my pick lines when I start that, if I want to do that, because I don't know if I want to do the pick lines or not. I just don't know what I want to do yet. I know I want to do the herbal. So, I mean, it's, it's, it's really my decision what I choose to do and what's, what's best for me. Sorry, my, my tree out in the front yard right at my window is like starting to bloom millions of little itty bitty flowers. So my, my windows are open and my sinuses are going to town. So I apologize. Um, so it's just, I, at the beginning of all these, I told you guys it was going to be my lime life, my story. So, sometimes we're going to get off the beaten path of talking about lime and showing on my good days of me not being in the house. And maybe, hopefully, with God's grace, showing what I used to do on good days, being out in the woods and you know, it's my life, and I mean, if, if I should die tomorrow, I, I hope that my story or my video should, could help somebody, that there's always, there's always that good, or that looking for, forward to tomorrow, or always finding the silver lining, no matter how bad it is, I mean, like, I, I hate this packing. I hate packing. I have done nothing but packing. I have been stuck with all the packing. I didn't mind it when I was healthy, but now my muscles can't, my body can't take it, but I'm stuck doing it. So, but at the end of it, the day, even though I hurt and I'm sore and my silver lining is the peace and the quiet and knowing I don't have to deal with all this rat race around me. That's my silver lining. I can I can sit on my front porch and go and not worry about traffic or neighbors or druggies or tweakers or my dogs having to bark because of idiot people. Yeah. So, I mean, that that's my silver lining. You know, and I mean, there's going to be bad. 
parts to it, but I got plenty of books. I, I, I love my Edgar Allan Poe, so, and my friend yesterday come up, and she gave me stacks of books, and she knows I love to read. I love horror books. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a Stephen King fanatic. I love Stephen King, and I love Edgar Allan Poe, and the dark, twisted, dark horror books. Not this crappy horror movie crap that comes out on TV these days. That's that's not horror. That's BS. I mean, I like the old Stephen King, the old... Now, mind you, I like... I'm looking forward to the new It movie. Even though I like the Stephen King It book, I'm looking forward to the It movie coming out. See, now I'm rambling. And I should be <laughs> finishing packing. But... I'll, I'll post and I'll, you know, since I said this is going to be a journey of my lime life, and if I have good days, you know, I'll post outside my house if I feel good enough. Because, I mean, aren't we supposed to? If we have good days, enjoy those days. Post about those days. I should not just be sitting here in this chair on my good day, posting on a good day. Unfortunately, I'd be outside, but... The wind is blowing and my allergies are ugh, today, so. But on good days, we should be outside or doing what we enjoy when we have the energy. And I'm going to start doing that on my good days. Unfortunately, my good day today, and I'm, I'm so hyped on <laughs> B12 shots and um, cranberry apple juice. I'm good today. So this is a good day, and I, I'd love to be outside, but I, unfortunately I have other things I need to do. But for now, I'm going to start on my good days once I move up there this weekend, showing the whole basics of my my life, of my world, through Lyme and Spotted Fever, not just sitting here posting. it. it I don't need to just show about how the disease makes me trapped in the house. 80% of my time. I also need to show that 20% of when I do feel good, what I do when I have that time. So I'm going to wrap this up because I honestly am at 16 after 10 and I do need to take my, um, my second dose of pills and I need to get in here and finish packing. But I love you guys and, um, gentle hugs and I will post when I get up there and I'll try and post Friday. Well, no. Yeah, I will. I will post Friday cause I'll be up there on the mountain at the cabin, getting it ready for Saturday's move in. So I'll bring um, my computer and I'll, depending on how I feel, whether I feel good or not, I'll I'll record what it, what the house looks like up there, the cabin that we're temporarily, and then I'll come back here and I'll post it. So I love you guys. Be good. Gentle hugs. Hope you have a good day. Bye.